Hello everybody, I want to show you a little tutorial how to um, get an Innovaphone working. Uh, we have an Innovaphone in the internet. You can uh, reach it at uh, the following URL. Um, but if we want to do WebRTC technology, you have to um, use the HTTPS uh, link. And we want to take this link to get to the IP 800. Um, if you want to go to the PBX um, tab, you can go there when you will be asked for a um, password. The password is user demo password demo. Now we have to create two new users. Um, when you go to the PBX tab, objects and you click on show, you can see all the users already um, uh, installed in the PBX. And if we want to do a new user, we click on the new button. And now we take the Stefan, uh, long name, Stefan, display name, Stefan, and the name is Stefan. He gets um, the 20 as a telephone number and password is demo demo now we have an hardware id we will use a web rtc device and we will name it web rtc stefan and the name of the device is web rtc we have to click uh, config VoIP if we want to use it as a web rtc device then we click on apply we will click on the license button, the UC license, apply. And when we want to use WebRTC, we have to click on the WebRTC tab and choose WebRTC as device. That's ready. That's all for the Stefan. Now we will take another user called Lars. Long name Lars, display name Lars, and the name is Lars. And the extension is 21. Password is demo. And demo again, webrtc underscore last, device called webrtc, config VoIP, and apply. We will give them the UC license, apply, and webrtc uh, for the device webrtc. That's everything uh, you have to do to create the new users. And in the next videos, uh, we will show you how to use them. Thanks.